funny stories that I learned long ago and one of them was about Hanif Shanket. Hanif Shanket everybody knows. He was having an interview with Ariful Haq. Ariful Haq asked him what was it that had been so nice in your life? Any competition, any performance that you want to share with us? And Hanif Shanket said, oh you don't say that. In 100 meter run race, I was first and Ariful was surprised. How could you become first when you have a very ill health? Anip Shankar, everybody knows, is very much lean. It, once upon a time, I used to work in Dhanmandir Lake and there he used to walk. I to lo looked at him, he looked at me, but we did not talk, unfortunately. So he had been so funny and as he was uh, first in the 100 meter race, and what, what was the reason? It was surprising. And he said that, oh, you don't know. We know that in competition, fire crackers, a fire has been cracked. And that's how the sound, that's how the sound made us start running. So when he started running, there was not a firecracker. It was a shooting and the shooting was dangerous, everybody knows. So when he heard the shooting, he was so much afraid, he understood that he was going to be killed. So he was in a, such a position, he was so furious. He ran in a way to save him and he became first, can you imagine? So similar things happened to one of my friends, junior friends, Rakib. He, Makon, he was in Dhaka at the time and there was a caretaker government, it was in 1990 more than, I mean like that. So in 1990, uh, he was with his friends and police ran after them and they now fast, he sped up, pace sped away and he called me and said that I don't know, I was such a good runner, he did not know that he was a great runner. So he ran so fast because he was in terrible danger, you know, to avoid death. Everybody gets so furious. So he ran in a quickest pace and he was surprised that he could run so fast. Similarly, my friend, once upon a time, he had been my best friend. He lived in uh, Saudi Arabia. Now he's still living in that city. So he's even my uncle, but two years senior to me. So we're very friendly. So what he said is that he was right a kind of activist, a civil activist, and at the time there was the Fokrud in caretaker government in 1990, and they were chased by army, and he was so furious, he ran so fast, and at one point he got close to Ratshahi Women's College, and the wall is too high for anyone to get over the wall but he tried and he he just jumped over across the uh, wall can you imagine he was surprised and he whenever was moving with me towards that area he used to say that this is such a giant wall but i crossed it just because he was about to die he was about to be killed he, and it was such a serious situation that he could not but jump too high. It was impossible. So before the death, everybody wants to get rid of death, avoid death. And in that situation, somebody gets so much furious, so much powerful, so much light. He is not, suppose he was 60 years, 60 kg weight, right? He had been 60 kg, but at the time he became maybe 10 kg, like you are on the moon and it happens that six times the uh, weight gets lessened. So if you are 60 in on moon, you will become 10 kg, right? So 60 kg becomes 10 kg in, on the moon. Similarly, when he was so much afraid of his death, he became... 10 kg when he was actually 60 kg and he jumped, he got all the energy, all the power, all the serious uh, thing that he got, uh, jumped over the 
a wall. Another thing is very interesting at the same time. In front of his house, that's a museum area, in front of the museum, the road, you know, the army person in Pukhudin's I mean, regime, that is the caretaker government, which was in 1990. There, the police, the army, they were crippling on roads, highways, especially in the streets. So in that city town there, you have seen museum, Shabha Hashkata, that on that road, the students, I mean, boys were playing carom, right? were playing carom. And then army vehicle came, patrolling car came, and they ran away, and army personnel broke, in, broke the carom board into pieces, just dropped on the road and slashed on, right? So, see, one other thing is what I remember, Mahabu uncle, the additional secretary, he had been in a situation like that. He, his father, Van Israel, and there, I mean, uh, was also Samsu, uh, Samsu Johar's son, uh, Bulu Shah. Right? So he was trying to get admission there in Dutchman College, and uh, that person was also helping in that situation. When they were coming back from Ratshahi, when they were in the uh, in the marshy place in a, in, at night, deep night, maybe it was at uh, nine o'clock like that they were coming or ten o'clock. So there were way layers. Uh, there were muggers. Sometimes you know in the old time what happens? People used to way late. So they were blocked and they were trying to get everything from them. And as the, that was at night and in the uh, open area in, um, in the field among crops, they were furious, they were so much uh, in danger. And he said that they moved at number of places. Uh, ran and ran and ran and ran and away and come and back and forth like that. So the same thing happened to uh, what happened um, I mean, because of the sacrifice, kur, I mean, Kurbani, in the Kurbani, right? What happens um, when uh, Ismail Salam was just pat tapping his uh, uh, ankle and his mother was running up to water because they were thirsty. So as the sand glitters, she ran and ran and she ran seven times. And that's uh, the time when Ismail as -Salam was patting his ankle and that's how the water got dippled, right? So the water dippled up and that's how there was the uh, you know well, kwa locally we Bangladeshi call it well. So kwa, so that's jom jom water. When you go to Saudi Arabia for what, what happens? You come back, you have jom jom kwa. It said uh, the water from that well, and even the pilgrims they bring water so the people. And drink. That's very precious. That's religiously very precious. And this is even better for your health. So interesting things. Let's, uh, so have your comment whether you like it. Please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.